based music player that is written in C. Today I will show you how to set up CMUSE and even including the detachable CMUSE feature. So you want to do is first install it via your package manager of choice. You find the documentation here on cmuse.github.io and it also lists out the features but I'll be showing you some of them. Uh, I'll show you the set of the detachable CMUSE feature. Go, let's do bash. I have to go in the bash because that'll become apparent for the CMUSE. There's multiple views for CMUSE. The first view is the artist album view, which is this one. And the second one is your library view. And then the third view is shows you your playlists. The fourth view shows you the play queue. And then five is your browser, so you could go and add music. Six is your library filters, so you can find the music that you're looking for. Seven is the settings, and that's it. How you control CMUSE is C is play, R is repeat, S is shuffle, and then shift C is continuous play, so it'll play through, it'll go to the next song. Then F is if you want to play the next song in, the, in an album or whatever. So set up detachable CMUs. There's a nice wiki page on the GitHub that tells you is when you put this alias in our either in our profile or your bash or ZSHRC. There's also a version that uses Tmux with that, but you add this alias. Then after that, you add this key binding to it. So. Let's go ahead and add that. Let's go to this. So to do that, it's like, since it navigates Vim-like, you just do colon, and then, well, in this case, paste that. That makes it so that when you hit Q, which it doesn't seem to want to do right now, you can go. But if you want to quit CMUSE, you just do Q. So if you do CMUSE, C and ZSH, it doesn't work because we've had that binding detachable CMUSE. But if we go back to bash, it's CMUSE. Um, Alright, I'll pause it and figure out how I can fix this. Okay, I'm back. Now, if we CMUSE, it should just in a terminal. And go back to bash, CMUSE. And then hit Q, it then should detach. So whenever we type CMUSE, hit Q, it should allow us to leave. And it should work. CMUSE, and hit play, space and enter, both work as play. By Q, it should leave. That's how you set up detach the CMUSE. Now, I'd be wondering how the, this will work right up here, which is my status bar. There's a whole bunch of different status display programs that you can use. And choose from clean instant messengers. Or you can even remote control it with CMUSE. But what I want to do is use a uh, something like this uh, DWM thing. But before you do that, you need to configure one thing in CMUSE, which is you need to set this your status display program. I wrote a simple script for called CMOS notify that signals to DWM blocks which the update this status bar if we go and edit it you can see that how it works is using CMOS remote is a query feature so a slash Q oh, CMOS remote Q it gives you the current information on the song playing and these are just a series of grep and sed commands that pull from what the uh, CMOS remote and puts in here. And then this is just controls that or DWM blocks. Well, if we scroll up and down, it should increase the volume. CMUSE also has themes that you can choose from. So you can do color scheme and then this is the cyan one, it makes everything cyan. It's kind of hard to see, so you can choose a different one. But 
than the default. And we have Dracula. But I'm just gonna use the default. Then you, you can also create your own as indicated by the these. So and that was Simus. Hope you learned something. Like a comment to help the algorithm and have a nice day.